95% of our decisions are made by how you feel in the moment. And that is the problem. Do you feel like getting up? No. Do you feel like making that cold call? No, you don't. Do you feel like doing that third set of reps? No, you don't. We make decisions based on our feelings and that is robbing you of joy and opportunity. I will my way to the top. Some of you got that same fight in you, but you fight people. You still cussing folk out. You still laying hands on people. That's the easy fight. Now fight your bad habits. Fight your addictions now. Fight your laziness. Fight your procrastination. Take that energy now and fight to get a degree. Fight to start a company. Fight. Most of y'all where y'all are because you never take ownership. It's always somebody else's problem. It's always somebody else's fault why you didn't do what you were supposed to do. It's not their fault. Take ownership. Take the parts that belong to you. Why? Because I'm the one that's messing up opportunities. I'm the one that keeps repeating my past. And you need to free yourself up and start doing something new. But you can't do new until you get rid of that old. Cut it off. Cut it off. Cut it off. Do what you're supposed to do. You ain't no boy no more. Understand every time you point the finger that what you're saying to your dreams and goals is, I'm about to put you on hold. You got to take ownership. I take full responsibility. And I'll do whatever it takes. I take ownership. I'll get up. I'll stay late. And that's why you point the finger. Because you don't like how the pain feels. That's why you say he did it and she did it. That's why you give the power away, because it hurt too bad to say, I did it, I take ownership. It was my fault. That's why you point the finger. You ain't ready for the pain. You grow. You got ideas. You got talent. You got gifts. Stop shrinking down. Stop minimizing yourself. Take the risk on you. Take the risk on you. You owe you. And there's some of you, you know what you want, but you are not personally willing to do the work it takes to get it. What you're trying to do is do what you've done on this level and get the next level. You're like, I'm getting up every day. I'm lifting weights. I'm eating right. And I'm not getting the opportunity. It might require getting up and working out three and a half. It might require you saying no to your friends. It might require you changing your diet. It might require you moving to another city. Whatever it takes, you got to be willing to do it. And you keep saying you're not there because of something else because it's easier to blame somebody else. I have to take complete ownership. Internally, I had to look at all the things that I didn't have control over and say, I got to take control. Everybody want to be a business. Everybody want a six pack. Nobody tell you the pain that come with it. You're putting in work and just because you can't see the results, you want to quit or give up. I ain't never quit. I ain't never give up. I ain't never give in. I just kept grinding. If you keep going, you're going to break through. The only people that don't break through are the people who sport we're watching. When you go out there, I need you to have that dog. When you get out there, I need you to kill or be killed when you get out there. We ain't playing no more. We ain't taking no prisoners no more. When you get out there, whatever you can get, go get it. Because they gonna get it before you get it. And they ain't gonna give it to you. So you go out there and get what's yours. When you leave this room, you take care of on every single thing. I don't care where you come from. I don't care what your background is. Don't let nobody fool you. If you willing to grind on Monday, if you willing to grind on Tuesday, they can't stop you. I don't have to accept the life that was given to me. I can create my own reality. 